nila? I think um, being in Indonesia this year and Hong Kong, I think we're more focused with our run because here in the Philippines, it's actually surprising for me because when they said that they were going to kill a person, I didn't kill a person. Wow! That's what I'm saying. It's not one, two, it's in the top three. It's always a joke. It's always a joke. It's always a joke. It's always a joke. In the top, the podium finisher. In the, siguro ano lang, mas mas may yung attention namin na sa tapo lang when you're in the other countries. That's why I'm excited for next year also because it's gonna be my first time in Vietnam. Naman, cah ang sarap di ba ng pakiramdam that you're bringing the name of the Philippines outside. So, Pero pwede rin mag-intay doon sa mga kasama. <laughs> friendly race kasi ito eh. Ah, friendly ba? Akala ko kasi competition. Akala ko may cash prize after. <laughs> As Encho for you. <laughs> oh! Diba you were just talking about swimming with Encho? Yeah, we had a tennis here before. It's called Boys Town. Papunta pa lang po ako. Nagsiswimming pa lang po. Papunta doon sa kabilang side. Pabalik na si Encho B. Ano sa kabilis? Nag-swim ka ba doon? O si Encho? Si Encho lang. Hindi po siya tao. Isda. Isda si Encho B. And I believe, Ms. Mai, that uh, Fanny earlier announced that we will have our health and wellness ambassadors um, for uh, Asia. I, I believe some of them will be coming over to Manila as well. So, uh, for our resolution run next uh, January 2020, Miss Vietnam, the runner-up of Miss Universe, will be joining our Philippine Sun Life resolution, which she happens to be the brand ambassador of Sun Life Vietnam. And also, I forget his name, but the celebrity from Malaysia is also joining the Philippine Sun Resolution run. Exciting. Exciting. Exciting times for the resolution run. Can't wait for January 2020. Can't wait to have you. Can't wait. Yes. Can I propose it? Can I propose it? Let's make this about you guys. But to answer the question, it's not yet. Any more questions? Ladies and gentlemen, this is Astra Moyo. I'm Miss Astra. Hello, good afternoon. I didn't hear you. I'm sorry. I'd like to ask you, Muna, uh, well, the, the, uh, the people behind, of course, the success of uh, Sun Life. I just want to ask, because I'm getting the good partnership you with uh, uh, Piolo no, for, the, uh, for the longest time. So, Una, I just want to know why Piolo? Why did you consider him for the very, I mean, out of so many, so many uh, stars or talents, or popular actors, why Piolo? And what's the secret of the long partnership? So 11 years ago, when we were looking for a partner in um, showbiz who would help us spread the message of you, because in the Philippines, insurance and investment is not a popular product. Most Filipinos don't appreciate it. So while we've been here for 124 years, imagine, parang konti pa rin Filipinos na nakaka-appreciate sa service namin. So at that time, we were looking for someone who can help us spread the message of how important it is. And Piono happened to be the first choice talaga because as we all know naman, Piono's popularity, number one, cuts across everyone. Hindi lang sa ibang class, the, the whole population. Number two, we had to pick someone who really embodied the values that we wanted to espouse, which is yung financial responsibility. And you can see naman, through the years, that Piolo has really been a financially responsible person in terms of managing. So, she yung talagang gusto namin going role model for Filipinos to emulate. And then, of course, you know, we shared all sort of advocacy, hindi lang sa financial planning, pati sa health and wellness. So, talagang it became a perfect match. And then, we kept on, ano na, uh, pursuing that relationship because we really saw how much it helped. So, if you, just to share, no, when we started, only three out of ten, would recognize Sun Life. Kahit tanungin mo, narinig mo na ba ang Sun Life? 3 out of 10 lang ang mag-yes. Nakatulong talaga malaki when we started partnering with Piola. Now we're known by everyone. So it has really helped ano, spread our message and we thank Piola for that. So, Piola. Reaction from Piola. Happy birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday. Ang birthday ko pala. Kala ko birthday. Ah, what can I say? Uh, I don't know what to say. I'm, I'm still trying to process what with, with Miss Mylene said. Uh, gosh. Uh, it's one of the, the, the most important things in my life, not because of my uh, stay in showbiz, but you know, it's, it's become part of my life with my son, with the foundation. Uh, I always have to reiterate that because for me, one of the 
uh, uh, reasons why I stay in the business is because you're able to do something to pay it forward. And Sun Life has always been a great partner uh, in it being, be, to be able to do that. So, sana, yun, marami pa kami magawa. What I appreciate about Sun Life is, like what Ms. Richard said and Ms. Princess, na talaga, grabe yung the way they make new uh, events. And every year, they make sure it's different. And I also want to thank them for partnering with Star Magic. You know, uh, for the last few years, Sun Life has been the one who really uh, pushed health and wellness with Star Magic. So with all the events that have been happening, and all my friends with Star Magic, grabe yung support. So that, that's, I, I guess, what makes Sun Life relevant because of their concern to society and to health and well-being ng tao. Thank you po. Okay. Kung kanina kinilig, kasi may smiling ngayon, kinilig si Viola Pasquale. Okay, we have here Alan Sandon, our global friend. I just want to ask, ano, Piolo, tawag dito, kanina may pagbabanta kay Enchom, di ba? Nahan health and wellness lang siya. Hindi ko may natatakot na yung San Biology maging Enchology na. Because of... Mas idea. Parang mukha wala na ako na ibig. Parang sa mga... Sandali sa pangalan pa lang, parang ayoko eh. Enchology. 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 We're brothers. I've known him since he was in school. And Lorenzo is really one person. Nakita mo naman. Kung ako makikita mo ako average finisher, he always finishes on top. And it's just one person that would really inspire you. And it's so nice to emulate kasi he puts his heart in everything. Kaya nakakatawa. Can I just add, because I think not everyone knows about it, but I remember we were having a conversation with my brother Nico Yabi. He said, treat Sun Life differently because it is not just an endorsement, it is a family. So for the longest time, I was wondering what, what does that mean? And now, now that I'm actually officially part of Sun Life, nakikita ko yung importance saka nakikita ko yung value nung pagiging part ka ng Sun Life because it, again, it doesn't stop with your policies it just continue with helping you even in your daily, daily routine so I'm, I'm, I'm glad that we also have like our Piola Pascual that we look up to, you know Si Piola, ano ba? You recommend uh, Encho to be part of it? Parang may say ka din ba to... No, hindi naman. Hindi naman po ako uh, stockholder ng San Life. <laughs> Partner lang po. Uh, no, uh, he's a welcome addition. Uh, when they brought up the idea, I was like, really? Because uh, he epitomizes your athlete, eh, sportsman. Eh. So, sino pa bang pwede natin ibigay na talaga mo masasabi mong legit na valid na talagang athlete? Siya lang talaga eh. So, yeah, uh, hindi naman po nanggaling sa akin. They, they know, of course, they had to do research and really, hindi naman nagtagad eh. Same thing, one year, di ba? Before they, two years, two years, tanong. Sa akin mo naghintay, no? Okay, thank you, congratulations. Mind you, Anchong T is part of the national team. He was part of the national team before, for swimming. I, I think what uh, what's special about this is that what we can realize from here is that Piola really set the standards for brand ambassadors, especially for the ones who came after him and joined Sun Life. We tend to look for the same kind of relationship that we have in him and those who we will consider in the future. Because it's a different class in our relationship with Piola. So of course, we want to maintain something like that with all the other brand ambassadors. Na legit, uh, I mean, genuine, sincere, and talagang long-lasting. And in what our campaign says, really attacked by in what our uh, advocacies are. Diba? So that's what it's all about for us at Sunlight. A bit to me of uh, ambassadors talaga. Siguro yes. after this, maganda mag-group hug tayo. Yes. Yes. I think, think pag-una ko doon. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Miss Tess? Okay, we're down to our last two questions. Oh. We have here Natalie Tomala of Philippine Star. Are you going to be asking about Sunnelogy? <laughs> Ent Entology? Twenty-five years. So, pagkwento naman ba naging yun yung ayun na about Sun Life? Yes, we're doing the 125 years, so you can choose because it's it's a virtual run that you can do in a span of one month. You can you can clock in in every time you run. So for me, I I run once, twice, thrice a week, so I can easily do it in a span of a month. So it's a good goal to reach because at least if you're in the gym, usually you do ten 
you know, you, you do 15 or 5, it doesn't matter. But to be able to really gauge it and monitor it, mas maganda yung makikita mo yung ma-reach mo yung goal mo. Ah, so hindi siya outside, outdoor? Virtually. No, anyway, uh, I, I, I do a map I run app, I don't know if I can do that, but yeah, you can screenshot it. So, I really monitor all my all my trainings. So, maganda at least makukulay ko siya at makikita ko tagay distance na natakbo ko. So, um, yun nga, um, go, uh, they are taking inspiration from the run, resolution run. Ano pa yung mga fitness resolutions you hold that you've set for yourself? Well, for me, I started going back to um, training for... Iba pa yung school. And then I started going back to training for running because I'll be joining the Osaka Marathon in December. So, yung sinasabi niya 125 kilometers, it sounds mahaba, but it's actually doable. Kung talagang hilig mo yung pagtakbo, madali siya eh. Like, like kanina, before going here, I, I did my 10K already. So, if you accumulate that every week, it's doable. So, yun lang. I just want to be prepared for at least the Osaka Marathon will just be um, parang a breakfast of what I'm actually gonna do for some life for next year. Oh yes, same, same with me. I always committed to doing a uh, full marathon, which I haven't done because uh, maraming labada. So, ayun, at 42, I was gonna do a 42 at 42. So, I don't know, nakakaingit uh, kasi before, nag-commit ako sa Berlin. I was a full runner, and then I saw si Edge and I said, I'm sorry, but I hope I get to do it you know, soon. So that's my goal, that's my goal, uh, to be able to do a marathon. Yes. Nahanap eh. Actually, kanina pag-iising ko, tumak ko ako, nag-boxing ako, nag-badminton ako, bago ako pumunta dito. <laughs> Hindi ko na talaga mabigil ang sarili ko. I, have, it's, uh, I was talking to my trainer a while ago, but pag, pag lifestyle pala, parang hindi na, hindi, hindi na siya chore sa'yo. So it becomes, nakikita mo yung benefits, nakikita mo yung advantage na uh, you, you're more agile, especially as you're getting older. Sobra yung sarap na mararamdaman afterwards. So I guess I got addicted to the feeling of the energy that I get, the uh, yung yung happy endorphins na nakukuha ng mga atleta pag naka-train ka, nakapawis ka. So, hindi siya nakapagod. Nakaka-revive siya, actually. Nakabata. Yan naman. Nakabata. 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 Okay, thank you, Rich. We have here another friend, Mia Antonio. Hello, Paul. Good evening. This question goes to Ms. Torpiola. Kasi ako nang enjoy me. I know everyone wants to Pero sa dancer ni Pondalawa, what drives you to engage yourself actively in this kind of event? Actually, for me, it's more of um, a no-brainer because since I was six years old, I've been an athlete. So, it's weird for me to stop. Kung baga mas mababago sa akin yung timpla ng, ng katawan ko if all of a sudden I stop doing exercise. And masarap din, totoo yung sinabi niya kayo na kapag nasimulan mo, dire-direcho. So yun lang, I think more than being um, mindful about my health and being mindful about safety of all the activities I'm doing. Kasi hindi mo maiwasan, minsan tumatakbo ka, bigla ka nalang may sasakay na mga, mga katabi, di ba? Or kunyari tumatakbo siya, nahahabol siya ng mga fans. Masaksak siya. Hindi, <laughs> <laughs> joke lang. Hindi, joke lang. <laughs> my, my take, I guess, uh, since you know it's a given that uh, personally you like the benefits, but it's also to inspire people, you know? Uh, it's not just about doing it one time, but the consistency and the constancy of it. So it's not about how you look or uh, how, what, what, how old you are. It's just about really uh, starting somewhere, somehow. So that's really my main goal, to really inspire more people to live healthier lives through all these uh, events that we have.